Good day, explorers. Mr. Reinhardt from Miss Bianchi's Kindergarten class again with you today with another book. This time a little bit of a detour from nonfiction and community helpers. We're going to go with just something a little fun for today. And this one is called Dog Loves Books by Louise Yates. Dog loved books. He loved the smell of them. He loved the feel of them. He loved everything about them. Dog loved books so much that he decided to open his own bookstore. He unwrapped, unpacked, and stacked the books ready for the grand opening. When the day of the grand opening finally came, Dog had a bath, dried his fur, blew his nose, and threw open the door to greet his new customers. But there was no one there. So Dog tried to keep busy. And then, a lady came into the store. I'll have a tea with milk and two sugars, she said. I'm sorry, said Dog, but this is a bookstore. I only sell books. The lady walked out. Dog was alone. He waited and waited. Then a man came into the store. To ask for directions. When he left, Dog was downhearted. But not for long. He wouldn't wait a moment more. Dog fetched a book from the shelf and began to read. When he read, he forgot that he was waiting. When he read, he forgot that he was alone. When he read, he forgot that he was in the bookstore. And when one adventure ended, Dog simply took another book down from the shelf and... A new adventure began. Dog was somewhere else altogether when... A customer came into the store to ask for a book. Dog knew exactly which ones to recommend. Dog loves books. But most of all, he loves to share them. And there you have it. And I do too. Just like Dog, I love sharing books with you all. I hope you enjoyed that, and I hope you have a great uh, great afternoon, and I will see you next time when it's story time with Mr. Reinhardt. Until then, have a great day, explorers.